What's up outdoorsmen, Greg here, and today we're talking about leaning and sitting in a tree saddle. But before we do that, roll that intro. All right, like I said, we are talking about leaning versus sitting in a saddle setup. Now the biggest thing that makes the difference whether you are a leaner or a sitter is your platform, in my opinion. Uh, but the difference, first of all, is whether you sit down, kind of like in a swing. Uh, imagine if you were on a swing set um, growing up. That's sitting when you have 90% of your weight in the saddle. That's called sitting. And if you're leaning, you're imagine leaning your butt up against the side of a table, like a pool table or a dinner table or up against a counter, something like that. And you're kind of leaning. So... 70% of the weight is in is in your feet or uh, your legs and then 30 to 40 percent or so is in your butt in the saddle and that's kind of the main difference between leaning and sitting and most guys do a combination of both uh, but then you'll have some guys that are pretty much all leaners or pretty much just sitters and uh, the difference is 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 really comfort based on what works for you there's no wrong way to do it. You can be a leaner, you can be a sitter. Um, and like I said, most of that is gonna depend on your platform. If you use a ring of steps platform, you are more than likely going to be a sitter just because of the geometry of how your feet go around the tree. That's gonna make you uh, tend to wanna sit a little bit more. Um, there are also more positions uh, in the sitting, I think, with, you know, you can straddle the tree with your legs. Uh, you can sit side saddle uh, with both legs on one side of the tree. There's, there's options for, for being a sitter. However, if you use a seat style platform, then you will more than likely be a leaner. And that's just because there's more surface area for your feet to be comfortable on that larger platform. And that's going to tend uh, for most guys to lean a little bit more. Now me, I kind of do a combination of both. I'll sit for 15, 20 minutes and, and, and rest against my knees on the tree, and then I'll lean for 15 or 20 minutes and, and do it that way and just kind of rotate back and forth. That seems to be a system that works for me. One thing to keep in mind, if you are a sitter, you definitely want some sort of pad for your knees. I choose knee pads, uh, but some people are using a pad, uh, like a tree seat or a tree seat cushion that you would strap onto the top of your tree stand seat or any sort of cushion that you could find, really sort of foam cushion, strap that around the tree. I think knee pads are a little bit easier. Uh, but that's the main difference between leading and sitting. That's it. Hopefully you learned a little bit about leaning and sitting and hopefully that will make you a better saddle hunter. Hey, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and then you know click on some of my other hunting and fishing videos and maybe you'll find something you like. Thanks again for watching and you guys get outdoors.